Hayes County law enforcement agencies have a warning for parents. Drug dealers are using social media to distribute lethal drugs to children. They are apparently sending code names to try and hide their tracks involving emojis. KXAN Sarah Alshay shares which ones to be on the lookout for. One that we see a lot here is the blue pill because it's representative of the M30 pills that we're finding here in Kyle. Emojis and code names. That they'll use the blue diamond and the blue heart again for the uh, fentanyl that we're finding in our community. Used by both drug dealers and young people on social media trying to exchange cash for illegal drugs. They may leave out the code and just say looking to buy something, who's got anything, who has something for us. Those that are dealing these drugs, they know that's an open invitation to sell to that customer. It's a problem that's directly hit the city of Kyle. Police Chief Jeff Barnett says social media is used to distribute these lethal drugs. This year alone, they've had 25 fentanyl overdose calls, seven of which resulted in death. It can even be one piece of a pill, one sliver, one tiny piece of a pill can kill you, and we've actually seen that happen. The chief encourages parents to monitor their children's social media accounts, something that doesn't have to feel like an invasion of privacy. At least be more knowledgeable about about where our children are and uh, what kinds of social media they have access to. University of Texas professor of education Jennifer Adair says the first step is an open and honest conversation. If we're really scared of fentanyl, I think it's okay to tell kids that's why we're asking different kinds of questions. That's why we're trying to get more involved. Chief Barnett says these are important steps because if parents aren't persistent, he assures the drug dealers will be. They will push their product every chance and in every way that they get. Sarah Alsha, KXAN News. And Chief Barnett says there isn't one specific social media platform where these drug exchanges are actually happening. So he suggests to parents try to monitor all of them. Now for more on the different emojis and the code names, visit our website, kxan.com.